whatever your thing is, blank. Oh, sweet. Can I be a Nomad 2? Fuck yeah. Nomad oh. 2, that works. I'm Sandman good. 1, we're good. Sandman 1. Sandman. <laughs> <laughs> and you don't have to Get give it to me now, but here. just kind of, just think about I'll it. It needs to be quick over. saying, like, easy to roll off the tongue in two syllables. Yeah, that's that. two syllables. Or, or one syllable, like smoke. Hey, right, you're on a 7 1. Yeah, if you advised, uh, I do have my call sign now. <laughs> Copy, same man. Uh, and Rogative is Arrow and Port and Board. Uh, Arrow and Broken Arrow. Broken Arrow. Yeah, good point, Broken Arrow. Broken Arrow is a very important <laughs> word uh, that Cupper knows. <laughs> oh, God. Warlord Don't call those in. Smoke 5, 7 0. Yeah. Wait, wait, we don't yeah. get called that. Super Warlord, uh, Levi's, we got an active HA holding uh, area at uh, 157172. 157172, Roger, HA Chevy, visual. Warlord, smoke 570. Super Warlord. Warlord, request pickup. Uh, gonna be squad size element LZ Raven 145. Break zero six three. Frequency will be seven one. Call sign will be smoke five. Uh, go ahead and push vicinity of HA Chevy and advise me when on station. Uh, well, uh, HA Chevy contact uh, smoke five on seven one. All right, uh, super. Where everybody wants to zero. So now this point, wait, wait. Uh, My radio is on seven. They're talking internally. And Warlord is talking, they're talking on their 160 or uh, 65 long range. And they're uh, saying, hey, I need five? somebody to get in a super. Right? And when that super hey, can you hear me zero? Now, yeah, now he's zero. telling them, he's hey, giving him, what you call Warlord, who is rabbit uh, Warlord, is giving them the brief that I just super gave Super 61 from Warlord, so I request you push HA Chevy, contact, this is good. Uh, contact Smoke 5 on channel 771. Copy Smoke 5, channel 7. That's why you just need to kind of let them know the... Super 6-1, this is Smoke 5. I have you, Lima Charlie. Uh, gonna be pick up for squads as element LZ Raven 145, break 163. Advise vicinity of HA Chevy. Oh, fuck, Copy, currently uh, holding an HA Chevy. Let me know when you are uh, ready for me to come in. A from Vivas, ground force is PZ posture. Recommended egress, ingress, egress is pilot discretion. Known threats 300 meters to the north, northwest. Smoke pops on approach. Copy. Requesting mark and copy on uh, threats 300 meters northwest. Super so one is contact orange smoke. Roger. Contact orange smoke. Oh, dude, look at that. It's so beautiful. Yeah. Look at that. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. I believe. Oh, beautiful. Oh, there's another, there's another super here. Come on, guys. What is that? Well, I, I heard the, I heard the other super terrible. here, but I didn't know where he was. Oh, he's behind you. Why would you terminate on a hover? Come on, guys. Well, uh, he terminated, so I was like, well, I'm gonna cross rotors. Well, like, Cause I didn't know there was a second like super! Smoke 5, we are all in, all in, all in. Easy clean. Copy lifting. Copy lifting. Oh. Well, I didn't know you were coming with me. My bad. So, when, and, and when they're coming in, and they're, they're kinda about to touch down, if you need them to move up a little bit, you can just ask for them. Yeah, I was not aware of the other or, aircraft, so I just heard it coming. Or I don't and, have my uh, animations running right now. Slow it down. But you could request, so if you, if you have the ace animations, you could do like the hands up thing, and then you, you kind of indicate the touchdown point. Don't worry, Barl, the next one will be better. You know me, I always gotta be a nuisance. It's better, start using 160. I am using Communicate 160. with each other aircraft. Well, I, I didn't know he was coming. Oh, well, yeah. That, that is on me. That is on me. Also, I'm, I am flying stick and pedals now, so I'm still trying to get used to them. You uh, you do look much... Um, much smoother. Yeah, it's not like the janky, like, fucking just... Fucking... Boom! Yeah, so they can... They're really smart, right? So if you say...
they squat those element, then they'll be like, okay, I'm gonna go, uh, bank right? muscle, then turn element, back around for Chevy. Then, you know, they know you send a 47. Yeah, well, um, if you ever want an asset, you can be specific, saying, hey, I'm requesting a 60. Not necessarily you're always gonna get it, but, you know, it doesn't hurt to ask. Yeah, yeah, so, like, the, the very the, the very condensed uh, version of a request would be, like, hey, requesting, uh, uh, let's see, requesting a squad size element, uh, exfil for a uh, squad size element, uh, you know, push HA or HA Chevy contact me uh, into the one, wh whatever your call sign is. Okay. And you could send you could send the HLZ brief too on the net, but sometimes it's really clustered and you don't want to. But sometimes it is a good practice right? too because it's, you know. Okay. It, it lets the bird know where they need to go in case they can't contact you. Just gonna kind of stay in orbit around Chevy. Or What's that? Or would, would I put the brief on the 7071? Uh, just do it with the aircraft. Don't worry about sending it on 70 right now. Okay, you so can do that later when you get more experience. Alright, so do you want me to contact Warlord now or...? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so I'll be... Warlord number 2. Uh, 7 Warlord. Uh, Warlord, uh, no method requesting a platoon... Uh, sorry, a squad size pickup. Uh, HLZ to be marked. Grid reference one four five break one six three. They've been requesting uh, uh, contact name and frequency. Copy contact name will be Nomad frequency will be seven one. Confirm Nomad seven one. User left your channel. Now you just wait. Yep. Yes. Now you just wait. Wait, did I say that right now or did I say in direct? <laughs> oh well. <laughs> you you said in direct. You said that on 6-5. Uh, Super 6-1, so this is Warlord. Can, or you, so you don't have to use Send. Okay. No, Infirm, uh, I got a squad size element uh, in uh, Xville. I need you to push now. HA Chevy and contact Nomad 7-1. Got to push yeah. HA Chevy and contact Nomad 7-1. Uh, you, uh, you wouldn't want to... Six one seven one. PZ push if you're taking contact like northwest 100 meters, we're taking like a heavy contact, either RPG fire or machine gun fire. You want him to go right, to an so HA. Switch to radio seven one. Okay. Yeah. No mad. Super six one seven one. Oh shit, my shit's fucked up. Hold on. Alright, there we go. There we go. Red check seven one. No mad. Super six one seven one. Send it. Copy, be advised, we have a uh, two ship stock or a super flight that is uh, holding currently at HA Chevy. Hey, firm. Uh, Wait, do, uh, where, do, where do I go from there? So, if if your element's ready, let them know. If they're if you're not ready, just say Roger. Like that's just an acknowledgement call. But if your element's ready, then you just say Roger. Element is PZ Posture LZ Raven. You know, one four five break one six three. Let them know. Hey, real quick, uh, when you guys yes. check in, just uh, and, and good practice. Know, just uh, let them know what mission okay. you're on. Okay. So uh, uh, so okay. It's fine. You're good. Seven zero flight. Be advised. Uh, pick. Uh, we're currently at a uh, posture pickup. PZ, just PZ, take you're good, man. PZ slow. posture. Sorry. You're good. We're currently just... at PZ posture. Uh, grid as follows: one four five break one six three. Marked by smoke. Copy 145163 marked by smoke, then be uh, in from your east. Hey, firm, uh, be advised, uh, last known threat from the west. I am contact your yellow smoke. Dick Copy on uh, contact to the west. Yeah, so the more you do it, the better you'll, the better yeah. confidence you'll get. And, you it's know, the west, so like you just didn't, you know, stumble, uh, stumble on your off to and stuff like that. When, when, yeah, when you get into an op, too, you get like really into it and you, you get really focused. I'm just trying to land a little bit past the smoke, so just right close to that uh, concrete. LZ Brief would just be like, hey, HLZ Raven at grid 145, 163. Uh, we'll mark our smoke. Yeah, and then threats. That makes sense. That's my mind. You're good, you're good. No, you're good. You're doing awesome. You're first on Can we lift, just, uh, Whatever. lift and go left, uh, or, like, lift and rotate left and go northeast? Super fly, we're all in. Captain, super fly, lifting. You'll learn that there's several ways to say stuff sometimes, so, like, but, hey, It's all definitely weird left, using or, stick now. Hey, definitely a on. lot, like, slower Did movements. <laughs> But definitely smoother. Yeah.
Oh, yeah, let's let's uh Can let's get Archer to do all this cool brevity. I would like to, just but I know it's gonna fuck everything more. up for me. Yeah, I know that's the thing is that's why I'm like doing it now, and then when I get when I get to op, you, you probably will, I, I don't you, even know if I'm gonna switch yet. You will pick on the brevity, especially. If you're uh, I know it's gonna fuck right up like something enormous, so I'm not even gonna touch it. Oh, are you ready? I'll pick up on it. All right, Archer, send it. Well, this is wrong freak. Sorry. Seven zero. Seven zero. Yeah, yeah. Warlord is Havoc 3, how copy? Havoc 3, this is Warlord 10. So we get a water, we should do a, uh, like, another Press thing. A, we pick up the squad size element. Uh, push the HA Chevy, contact the... Havoc 3 Sorry, on 7-1. Hey, from Chevy, Havoc 3, 7-1. Uh, burning route, ETA, on 7-1. Uh, Chevy, Havoc 3, 7-1. 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 Chevy, uh, it's an We got uh, two, 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 ship. two flight. Yeah, two ship. There you go. Uh, Roger. Uh, requesting you uh, push AJ Chevy uh, for squad size element XL contact. Ha uh, Havoc three seven one. Kevin come back. Havoc three seven one. Push AJ Chevy. Good back. Havoc three super six one. Super six ones. Havoc three. Uh, Question pickup for squad at LZ Raven. Uh, great ref. One four five, break one six three. Uh, contact in thirty seconds out. Super one copies. Uh, we'll let you know in thirty seconds out. Be advised, we have a two ship stalker uh, super flight. Havoc three super six one. If the uh... super is havoc three, uh, blue smoke on deck. Nuclear land. Copy looking. I am contact blue two blue smokes. Now clarify what no, blue smokes are. Specify, yeah, specify. So let him know that it's the most Which one's gonna be uh, your guys'? Copy concept. Uh, westernmost blue smoke. Clear the line. Superflight copies westernmost sm smoke. Yep. So that's gonna happen. That can happen a lot. Is if, if your if ground force ever... is using smoke. Yeah, if you ever get in a situation where you don't know where the other blue smoke is, you can literally, so you would do correlation, be like, hey, do you see a row of uh, MRAPs? Mm -hmm. uh, do you see a column of row mats uh, oriented, you know, north to south? And you say, yeah, that blue smoke's your LZ. Yeah. <laughs> this is weird. All in, all in, all in. PZ Queen. Pure lift. Copy, you're flight lifting. Man, you guys are high speed, dude. This is a day one. Talking about boys. These are my kids, man. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> are we gonna run an internal frequency? Is that okay? If so, what's the Yes. So, we, so we JTAC frequency, uh. I don't know. We're having a bit of desync over here. 170 is JTAC freak. Alright, sounds good. It, it's completely different now, switching from like mouse yeah, and keyboard to keyboard, <laughs> stick, and pedals. No, man. Good work. Good help. Okay. Nah, man, they just same thing with Harper, just repeating. Should we just repeating all I mean, the pedals aren't too like, hard. If you, like, oh, you just keep repeating like, all, all so it looks good. Honestly, you'll yeah. understand yeah. it all. Right. Right. Just, or would you plan on doing cool. ECAST tonight? Uh, I mean, we could. Could help Yeah, with, like, maybe just like base fire missions with Yeah, you want to do like a base fire mission? Yeah. We'll just do one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Can I grab it? Alright, so guys, oh, hey, yeah. hey, hey, hey. You have to go to Sleepy. I don't know why I keep calling no, 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 Super uh, Stalkers. I'm gonna ask if I can still form and go do like uh, practice more on five lines and nine lines. Okay. If that's cool with you. That's cool. Okay. Form in. Once extended. And if you want to go to Ferguson, you can. Alright, that's good. Let's stop by. Just fixing our radios. So, what we're going to do is air to ground strikes. Okay? So, we're going to air to strikes. Hey, uh, push 7 2. Me, strikes. you, and Ferguson are going to work on five lines and nine lines. Sound good? It's not called that. Copy. But uh, that's how we're going to refer to it. Oh, push 7 2. Sometimes it's. Well, Alright, not, pushing 7 2. That's not how we're going to refer to it. It's not just him we're talking about it. Okay? So, you need to know this, okay? If you hear the word fire mission, it means. So, if you, if you say fire mission, it means automatically you're cleared to engage. Okay? So. If you say, 
hey, fire mission, and then you send your fire mission brief, it means you are you're giving the bird code again. Try not to buzz the rasp site, he says, as he buzzes the rasp site. Close? I just realized. In which you can okay. stay um, danger close. You're for cast for me. Or you uh, stay so at my command. Getting a blade, I guess, okay. if you want. For so if it's minutes. danger close, then you're going to need to clear well, safe. Well, she said it just as I was above the rasp site, so. Yeah, I okay. know. That's why I just said try to do it too much. I kind of understood that you were going to do it, but. I got turned already. I didn't realize I was above the rasp site. Yeah, no, I honestly forgot until I looked at the C tab and saw people on it. What'd you say? Do we just call it only fire missions, or what else can we call it? Like, if you need munitions. Just fire missions, so you're gonna throw it to his fire mission. Hey, right, hop All in right. a, um, For now. Hop in right. an outlaw. So, here's, here's the general format. It's very easy, okay? And if you script the order, it doesn't matter, okay? It's just as long as these fundamentals are communicated. Okay. What your location is, and what your mark by, if there is a mark. Okay. Any new description. Enemy location and what the uh, enemy mark is. Alright. Can I steal the path? Can the, the requesting procedures go the exact same as in. I just put it anywhere. Uh, mission. The only difference is you may not necessarily be wanting them for a specific mission. So you, you would just say, you know, like Warlord, uh, Warlord Smoke 5, uh, requesting one gun. Right. Because yep. obviously. So it's they, it's apparent that it's going to be for closer support. Yeah, and so, like, you know. uh, so the situation that you might ask for a gun and be like, oh, hey, we don't have a gun, but we have an outlaw. Is that fine? And yep. you say, hey, yeah, that's good. But like um, I said, always request a gun. <laughs> yeah, if, to, if, uh, if they don't have it, then they don't have it. But it doesn't hurt to ask. <laughs> you just get up and go over to HS Chevy. Yeah. User yes. left yeah, your yeah, channel. User joined your channel. So, and let me say this one thing too. Um, for outlaw, okay, he doesn't have a targeting operator, right? If you give him a grid, this is the process he has to do. He has to open up his map, which completely blocks his entire view. He has to open up his map. He has to look on the objects on the map and figure out, okay, where is this location, right? And then he has to mark it or whatever, and then he has to fly to that mark and then uh, find the target, okay? That's the longest way. The quickest way is literally you know, either mark the target or mark yourself and do a reference from either marks. Yeah. Makes sense? So you can mark the target red smoke and say, hey, friendlies are west 300 meters. And the enemy is on the red smoke. Or you can Remember, mark give me your one location second, I gotta grab my uh, reference off of the, the, red, the, the blue smoke and say, hey, so this is, yeah, this west is where OPs meters. become. If you ever follow me in game, I put down like 50 OPs throughout the map. <laughs> because I, anytime I stop, I mark my position as an OP yeah. just in case a fire mission comes up and I can quick reference my position for all aircraft. So instead of giving them a grid or anything like really that, I just tell them, for any forces are OP, Mike, hostiles 300 meters west. You know? Grids and that's are super only simple. good for targeting pods. Yeah. Okay. So the, you'll learn that close air support, which is different with nine lines. Nine lines, dude, you're given, you're given, you're typically given uh, grids. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Because it's it's so easy to plug it in and then drop a bomb on it. <laughs> Alright, so. Warlords, smoke five, so Hey Marty, I have two tanks out there you can blow up. Okay, I just wanted some soft targets. Oh shit, alright. Huh. <laughs> we'll load smoke five sounds And he would say Sorry. Smoke five, warlord. And then he would just request the outlaw, and then outlaw would push again. seven one. Uh once he's ready, he'll come in with a brief. Hello one one. Send. Hey, request that you push 7-1, contact Havoc uh, 3, go ahead and push HA Chevy. Copy, contact Havoc 3, 7 one, pushing HA Chevy. So then this call's gonna be a little different. Hello 4-1, you have Smoke 5, 7 one. Oh, sorry. No, you're good. You say Havoc 3 or Smoke Yeah, sm Smoke's 1, Smoke's 1. My bad. So generally, there we go. Ready. Smoke five copies all. Stand by for. It. All right. So now that's it. That's just letting acknowledging. So at this point, he's just holding. He he can hold there all game, and we could just never give him a mission. Yep. Or we could do something like this and tell him to push to my location and go defensive overhead. 
And and sometimes sometimes you can you can do a situation update and get eyes on friendlies before there's even any targets ready to strike. Yeah. So let's just say in this environment it's just small arms fire, right? Yeah. So we'll, we're going to communicate what the threats are. So it's just literally just small arms fire, and then we're going to have a push over at. Well, yeah, so. there's MBTs. Okay, MBTs, that's fine. No, yeah, yeah, I just put some small arms up there. That's fine. Okay, okay. Yeah, they, um, they they MBT, though. Outlaw smoke five, same one. Question push vicinity of OP Mike. Known threats are going to be small arms to the east of OP Mike. So at this point, again, uh, you know, we're, we might be taking light contact, or we're not taking no contact. No, no this is Little Smoke, Levi's uh, situation update. Uh, friendlies are currently on <laughs> at the northwest uh, at a Burks building. Uh, we're troops in contact to the southeast, uh, engaging uh, uh, light mechanized, unarmed, and uh, small arms fire. Yeah, so at this point, we could be taking fire, or we could not be, um, and it's just not warranting, you know, a strike at this moment. So he's just, we're just having him push overhead so he can get better SA instead of just sitting in a holding area. But like yeah. I said, if you want, like, you can have him sit at the holding area the entire, you know, the entire game. But Would he uh, be clear to, like, I think he's requesting for smoke. the guys fucking us up, or would he, like, with guns, or... Uh, I'm a one from Will Smoke. You requesting for, uh, smoke on the deck for friendly location? If you're in blue smoke's out, call in, uh, call in, uh, contact with smoke, visual friendly. Alright, so now at this point we're engaging contacts, he's just pushing overhead, you know, he's just a new eye in the sky, right? Yeah. But, if we start needing a fire mission, we can just let him know. Outlaw, smoke five, fire mission. I have small arms contact, squats as element east of OP Mike 300 meters will be marked with red smoke. Where'd your smoke go? Oh, good smoke. Nice. So, oh, it's bad out, smoke. <laughs> okay, okay, now you give a correction call. So, yep, so, so now that it's out, he's gonna tally. Hey, for him, uh, Roger, enemies are 50 meters northwest of red smoke. Engagement ordinance is gonna be pilot discretion, ingress, egress, pilot discretion, nearest friendlies, 350 meters to the west, cleared hot, any direction. Beautiful. Jesus. Yep, so at that point, if you want him to hit it with rockets, he can. Normally, with things like this, they know what's best, right? So yeah, okay. I just let him take reins. And if there's no friendlies around it, and we're the only element, or we're the, we're the closest element, then I just, you know, clear him hot any direction. Nearest friendlies are 350 meters to the west, and just let him go, hey, you know, let him go haywire. And... Oh, yeah. <laughs> See, that's how it's done. Outlaw, man. smoke 5, BDS follows break. <laughs> Estimate 7 EK, negative rerun. Let, let's just do like, let's just do like a really standard fire mission. Okay. Okay. Uh, hey, uh, I'm with everyone, uh, requesting, uh, this is a little smoke. I request you push overhead, uh, to previous, uh, filming location on Blue Smoke. You still have visual on that location? Uh, it's neighbor, we push it. Neighbor. So, I'll just call a standard uh, fire mission. Uh, can you just put something down? Yep, you, you got uh, smart contact, same location. Alright, so I'm going to have you mark the, the enemies with red smoke. And uh, Archer, do you have blue smoke? Yeah, I do. Okay, on my command, you're going to uh, put blue smoke on the deck. I'll say, okay, go ahead and put blue smoke down. You put smoke uh, down too. Sorry, uh, outlaw from uh, Little Smoke Fire Mission. Send. Uh, my location is going to be uh, northwest side of the airfield, marked by Blue Smoke. Uh, enemy infantry in the open on uh, concrete uh, to my east, 500 meters, marked by Red Smoke. Copy enemies east, marked by Red Smoke, uh, 500 meters from location, Blue Smoke. I am visual on your guys' location with your enemies. Never. Uh, so from Red Smoke, uh, northeast uh, on the runway, approximately 100 meters. Copy northeast from Red Smoke. Uh, correction, uh, northwest. Northwest. Copy northwest. They're on the runway, correct? Never. Copy. I am tally on any position. Alpha one in. Uh, clear to engage us for uh, 
as usual for our front mission. So, so in this scenario, he did call in, and I and you, you typically would give the the cleared hot or cleared engage call for one just as please. extra security, but you don't you don't have to because if you if you call if you say the word fire mission, that means it's automatic conversion of fire. If you yeah. don't, and you get if you get. If you don't do that and you say, "Hey, my location's here," and then you point at enemy location, they they can't fire until you say "clear the engagement." Yeah. Okay. I always I always keep it up just so that yeah. you know it's a two street pilot. Like he, yeah. he doesn't be like, "Wait, did he say?" You know what I mean? So I just yeah. always say, "Give him an additional cleared hot," just so he knows. Okay, I can go pick. You know, I can go fucking go this guy and just know shit. In, di in different things you might hear, you might hear commit to engagement. That just means aircrafts starting the engagement. I love. Or Little Smoke, Alpha 4 one you to be advised, you're pushing to your northwest uh, around the same holding area. A from you get it complete. That's an A from you get it complete. BHA, good hits, uh, BDA, AK. Alpha 4 one copies all. Uh, no need for uh, re attack, uh, you're clear at RTV. No longer in contact. Copy, Alpha 4 one is RTV. Yep, so that's another thing, now that you guys are kind of acting autonomously, don't hog assets. <laughs> So if you're okay. done with somebody and you haven't taken contact for a while, or things are a little, you know, things are a little chill. Send them back to Warlord just so they can be retasked. Because you know you may be hogging up a gun or a Condor, and there's, you know, it's clear blue 22, no fire shot where you are, and your other JTAC, you know, three clicks down the road is getting fucking hammered, and there's no CAS <laughs> assets available. So don't be selfish with CAS. Uh, if you don't need them, send them back. That's not to say they don't like being on station, but you know, just kind of. You'll be on the, you know, we'll have JTAC frequency between us, so we'll kind of let each other know, you know, and we'll kind of update each other on the situation as far as what's going on. And we'll we'll have assets for like assets for like ISR and shit like that for what's available. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You are, like nice. I said, you are good to ask for anything. So it would okay. literally just be something like, hey, I need an asset for ISR, okay? And we're just gonna call out stuff to you. So we'll we'll learn more about the ISR and the fire missions and stuff on separate days. Like that's all separate topics each. And that way we can learn about one one topic, ISR, and then we can train on it. Oh, right. shit. We kind of had to put all this information together because we have an going outside or something, you know. <laughs> Do your first stop. Okay, okay, I'm done, man. We're training for better. And, and if, if you guys, if all four JTX are able to come, uh, I don't know if Marty, you're not going to be, you're gonna be busy. I will, I'll be traveling to Bliss, okay. so I might be here Sunday. Okay. Uh, we'll just task the, the more experienced JTX with you so they can help you out. Is Donnie gonna be well, I won't be available until Saturday. Uh, yeah, Saturday. I won't be available. Okay, uh, that's fine. I'm getting okay. a I don't know if vaccine is, shot. But we'll find somebody too. If we have a, yeah. uh, if we have a lot of pilots and we have a JTAC, we can just you know have one of the pilots run on the ground. Would you? Right. Would you like us to file um, LOAs yeah, for <coughs> other ops as well? What's that? Would you like us to file LOAs for like both yeah, Saturday and Sunday if we need to? Courtesy. Yeah, just put an LOA yeah. in the. That's the only numbers cool. I have. Yeah, just be like, hey, I won't make it Saturday, Sunday, you know, right? Thank you, Richard. Sunday is definitely 100% for me. Yeah. I'll probably be here both days, but I'll see Saturday for Sunday. I'll be here for Saturday for sure. I hope you guys are excited, dude. Dude, I'm freaking oh, yeah. pumped, bro. <laughs> dude, I, I love the comms. The comms is the best part, dude. It's, it's the, the comms and the work line. Able to get autonomous, and it's just you know us five, and we can kind of do what we want, run this how we want. It's gonna be good. It's gonna be real good. Yeah, yeah it's gonna be like, a lot so easier. Nice for me. Yeah. Uh, the badger cocks a barrel until you get me in your man bucket. Just waiting. But yeah, I'll uh, obviously you guys know where I'm going. So for the next you know a couple months, I will won't be available as much. Um, but once I get back, we're gonna really dive full fledged into this thing, and it's gonna be fun. Well, you know, after I spent time with Blake, she just yelled at me. She was like, she was like, when you get back, you have to spend time with me. <laughs> yeah, so, you know, after that, then we'll, you know. <laughs> oh, by the way, in the middle of the night, you yeah. JTAG. By the way, I have all the, I have all the documents. They're like all open source. They're all edit. Okay. So, it's very easy to revert to somebody put something stupid in there or something like that. But if you guys need to make changes, you know. Fix something you can. So, like Marty, if you want to add a section, or if you have, if you want to put anything in there, you can. I mean, I wouldn't worry about too much. It's just kind of there for a rough, a rough reference guide, you know, yeah. for the training. <laughs> and yeah, whenever yeah. I write one, I, sometimes I just I <laughs> I get lazy. Hey, <laughs> like, oh, I don't feel like writing this. Enjoy your channel. Later. And uh, 
and that's why they, like all of them are kind of unfinished. But they, they all have good intentions. Right. Yeah. It's, de- it's definitely a di- di- different use of these pedals. <laughs> uh, the situation is like, okay, I don't know what the actual procedure is here, so I, sometimes I just won't fill it in, and uh, or I'll just come up with something. But I try to want to get it as, uh, not as, I want to say as accurate, but you know, kind of as, as, my goal is kind of more realistic and uh, kind of based in the Arma universe, I guess. As immersive as possible. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, you know, I don't want to oversimplify it too, because I think we can handle it. We can definitely handle it, right? Yeah. So we're going to try to do nine lines of DCS, shit. <laughs> <laughs> that shit's fucking. We'll give you enough, you know. We don't want to be too simple because then it gets boring really quick. Yep. And with the new way the ops are going, it's gonna be it's gonna be good. It's gonna be probably gonna be required for us. Yeah. It's gonna be needed. But yeah, the biggest thing uh, for the JTAX is just you know, like I said, we're gonna be acting autonomously, and you're kind of gonna be like you don't even really have to stick with the platoon. You know, you start off with with the op. You can bounce in between, set up different OPs for yourself, but just don't let it become an issue where you're a hindrance to the platoon or to the ground element you know you should almost they should not even really know you're there you're just kind of the silent professional in the back who's talking to aircraft the entire time and you're just kind of doing your own thing um so make sure we're following sop i'll try to work on the peltors and get those backs just so we can have at least something cool um but you know just keep that in mind don't don't ruin it because we got a real good thing going when nobody's gonna fuck with us <laughs> so you'll typically be uh, talking to the commander so yeah and your beginning okay. commander's attempt. So, like, we, uh, and it's basically mm-hmm. going to be a platoon, really. Do we have to, like, like, platoon inserts and shit like that? So, like, do you have to like, be stuff? like, hey, I need a, I need a, uh, I need okay. a, a company wide exfil or something like that, right? Okay. And then yeah. you would handle it. Yeah, so right. he would, he would come to you and he'd say, hey, I mean, they might dictate the LZs. You can definitely put in uh, information, but generally, just like Barl said, how it's going to be is, let's say we're assaulting Telos and. He's like, hey, I want to platoon infill at Telos, and you, that's the intent. So you take that intent and you say, okay, where are the threats? You know, you you listen to the S2 brief, so they said the most of the threats are going to be on, you know, the the eastern side. So you're like, all right, I want to put up my LZ here and another LZ here in Flatland, you know, and then you coordinate with CAV to make sure that that's good with them. So you're going to normally get intent, and then you, you are going to be making the LZ and the PZ plans from there. Sometimes, again, don't feel bad if you get overstepped kind of with your job and they just decide where they want to go. It's going to happen. But, yeah. you know, it's, it's gonna going happen, to happen. And it happens in real life, too. Um, but you got to understand it's their guys, right? So yeah. sometimes like, they'll overstep. Serve, and we have to serve the ground forces. So as a yeah. tech, you're serving the ground. But generally, yeah, once they get... It's just making my job easier. Yeah, yeah exactly. And once, yeah. once they get pretty comfortable with you, you they'll kind of hand everything off to you. Yeah. That's, that's where after Marty just told us that like, when our ground guys come up to you, you say, fuck off. Yeah, it happens a lot. <laughs> cool. But if you see but, an LZ and it's like a really bad spot, <laughs> you know, yeah, don't be afraid. Tell like, no. Hey, we need to move this. I say, yeah. The, the important thing is the safety of the of the aircraft, which is also like the pilot can you know determine whether or not they actually mm-hmm. are gonna land there or not. And yeah. We'll kind of learn it as you go along, so you know you're gonna make mistakes. You're gonna make bad LZs, but I have <laughs> I have a feeling that you guys are gonna be great. <laughs> yeah, dude. I'm pumped. In terms of uh, being attached to platoon. Um, like for example, we have like two JTACs on uh, one night. Uh, one's gonna be attached to each platoon, yeah. Yep, that's how that's how it's gonna okay. be. Okay. Uh, and we should Harper, be on that platoon. Was it Harper just or to... Archie? Didn't you want you you wanted access to your old group platoon yeah, or something? I, I wanted back to two one because I missed them. They're okay, I think I think we can do that. You yeah, okay we can that do one? that. Yeah. Just like I said, don't get attached, but we can yeah. definitely do that. And the reason is because obviously the more you work with the six element, the more comfortable they're gonna be with you, and vice versa. So oh, yeah. you just kind of yeah. plan on you kind of finding a home with the platoon but just be ready to you know switch back and forth if somebody if one of you guys LOAs or something you need to cover down you know just kind of be ready for that generally I would like to see this as just the default of your radio makeups is the first UHF is going to be your fires freak second UHF is going to be the um 70 and then I'd like to have JTAC freak put put another V uh FM radio in your bag and have one of them on, you can also do this with alternate channels, but this is how I do it so it's easier. Have one of them on the JTAC frequency and have the other one on the platoon frequency. Um, that's the easiest way I do it. So that's only four frequencies, and that's not going to be a lot of stuff, um, you know, in your ear. Okay. You know, relatively. Yeah. Yeah, going back to the like platoon that. thing, um, if I could get, like, for first platoon, uh, Phoenix first, because, like, I can 
because sometimes they can they want to want me to help with like maybe trainings or platoon FTXs and stuff. Yeah. Yeah. yeah I mean, access, access, access platoon would be great for that, but like I'm yeah, I'm not worried about it. It's just, you know, you could also uh, to talk to those guys. You could also put an alternate on your long range too if you want to do that too. Yep. And put like your right ear because like so this this is six five and this is this is uh, seven one so this is on long range. Mm -hmm. And I'll just also, bounce between those two. Yeah, that's what I do too. One, one thing I learned as a JTAC when I was is never, don't be afraid to literally like change your channel to get off it. Like if seven zero is like nonstop talking and you're trying to talk to a pilot, literally you can just turn off seven zero. Yeah, literally just press like mm -hmm. control nine or something. Don't press all my long range. <laughs> Like, I was like, nah, I'm, I'm done. Yeah. And then as far as you mentioned platoon trainings and things like that, um, you can go to any, you know, squad training or platoon training if they'll have you. Um, once I get back and then once I kind of get settled in my, uh, I guess, in my routine over there, I'm going to be setting up another one of my jobs per Busby, being the liaison officer, is setting up joint trainings between JSOAC and, like, coordinating training and itineraries for joint trainings between JSOAC and Ground Force. Like, That's so, be epic. Well, yeah, so... Nemo talked to us, and he wants he wants us to come to the FTX. The thing is, no one tells us like, no one asks us because I'm sure like literally if they ask anyone in Cav, like most of Cav will just get on and help. Yeah, <laughs> we're yeah. we're all on almost every single night, just sitting in the team speak playing. Yeah, so any, any training you guys can go to, and if there's an air asset there, you can control. But yeah, that's gonna okay. be one of my jobs once I get settled uh, is doing joint trainings. But yeah, you mentioned going to FTXs. You can go to any of their FTXs. There's no there's no issue. Oh. Hey, if, if anything happens, like you know, on seven zero, uh, and you can't reach us, just just go to six five, or if there's like okay. some internal stuff that you need to share, just six five. Dude. Six five is like her, and kind of like our internal long range. But when channel. you're doing when you're doing a strike stuff. when you're doing strike, don't listen don't on six on five it. and record. <laughs> record. Yeah, yeah <laughs> listen. Yeah, like don't be on six. <laughs> <laughs> we talk about some dumb shit on 6.5. But yeah, don't get a habit of that either. 7.0 is really good because of SA. So it lets all yeah. of the commanding elements know that our asset's been requested to their AO. And it also, I mean, if we're all on, and it can happen where there's five of us on, um, it lets all of us know that an asset has been requested in, in an AO and that asset's no longer available. Yep. Or is back on station because it's, you know, back from tasking. So 7.0 is, you know, the golden child. Or you know it's okay. like somewhat in the area. Yeah, where you can easily call. All right. All right. Also, we're going to add all of you boys to oh, yeah. our JSOC internal channel on Discord. Couldn't you want to know? The stinky. This channel was created like a year and a half ago by the old leadership you. for a reason I can't remember, but we talk in there. That's the... why it seems really dead in JSOC. Chat. The reason is, is like if something happens, <laughs> we'll discuss it. Because User we don't want to sit there channel. and publicly state stuff in, in, in the yeah. JSOC channel. <laughs> oh, so is it about uh, like, so, yeah. Sometimes we'll use it to figure stuff out. Yeah, no. Just be like, careful. All of us can see that channel, the big boys. Oh, really? We have, yeah, we have yeah, Discord yeah. moderators, so we all see <laughs> Is that so, why people are so moving around is, all the time? Not, it is not completely... I've been listening, looking at that channel for like last year. It is not completely hidden. No, we know, no. We know that because... Uh, Oh, it, it, moves. About it, before yeah. thing, but, uh, so it just, just moves randomly. It's hidden from certain it's hidden people. It's hidden from everybody besides, like, yeah. JTF and Battalion. And Hagar and... Actually, no, Battalion doesn't even see it. So it's literally just me, Hagar, and uh, Hidden, but now I'm in it, so it doesn't matter. But Busby yeah. can see it, too? Busby might be able to see it. I don't know if he has the Me6 moderator tag, but nobody else can see it. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> So just yeah, just be careful what you say. Uh, like any anytime, like any videos and stuff, oh, normally we post them. Well, that's just something. Yeah, 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 just follow the guidelines. Like, you know, yeah. yeah, like posting stuff or like talking about like the because a lot of the stuff is like, like stuff. yeah, a lot of stuff is like you know, do really do people do people want to get a ping? Well, they're probably gonna have it muted anyway, but like you know. Yeah, we're not getting dicey in there. It's just <laughs> it's just <laughs> sometimes it's a little dumb. But... Yeah. But it was originally started back on when, when, when Cal and stuff, and Cal was having problems with certain people, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> or I don't know what it was, right? So I was like, hey, you know, we should have an internal because, like, so we could discuss these things because it's probably not what we think it is, right? Yeah. So we can argue or whatever, and that kind of turned into like a little bit something stuff. different. You can <laughs> see the hole I cut in my desk. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 
So and, you've been uh, uh, you've been looking on all the memes that we post every now. Yeah, they're funny. Some, I don't I don't look into it a lot because I have to. You have to go into the Mi Six like console. Uh, but that's why that's why all our channels are keep moving. <laughs> <laughs> that's not me. That's not me. Dude, I think it might be the me thing though, because like they just oh, yeah, keep moving all problem. around. It just, yeah, it would be like sitting here all of a sudden, like <laughs> we, the intern will be at the top, and then like in, like we've been making shit like, like what? Like what? All right, so smoke. You want to get off and go back to the the thing yeah. though? All right. Yeah. Thanks for coming, y'all. Yeah. Actually, yeah Sorry oh, for no, my boring a... briefs. You know, I okay. usually don't sit there and read through documents. That's how they are. Yeah, there's a there's a right right. If you have some time, I kind of want to do the fucking HLZ shit again. If you Free. Oh yeah, no, I'm done. Oh, Alright, so want to take your shirt off and wrestle? We're gonna do it tonight? How about we do it like tomorrow? No, no I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm done. done. Yeah. If right. If right. You wanna do it? Sure, yeah, yeah no problem. Yeah, it's just, yeah. I, well, this yeah, is a cool view, Sword 3. You want Sword? Yeah that's, yeah, that's fine. Yeah, man. Cool. So, uh, I'm Phoenix So, four. one is... Is it? And like, like that's... Yeah, yeah, the trains don't have to be approved or anything. Just a little bit of one. Yeah. What happened? Donnie's what? one. Donnie's one. Donnie's one. Yeah. Donnie, I'm gonna change that. I'm taking one from you. Oh, oh what one. am I gonna be now, dog? <laughs> You're five. You're five. Damn. Damn. <laughs> Get wrecked. I think the Actually, no. Donnie yeah. is. Uh, he's the most senior, so he's two. So we're just moving everything up. I'm just right, so I'm five. five. Uh, yeah. Uh, wait, where am I? No, three. As long as that's an F in it, I'm good. No, you're wait, five. No, are you f you're four. Aren't yeah, you? I'm five. Oh, yeah, yeah, Archer's five. I'm, so wait, so I'm yes. five and the lowest rank in here. Okay, so I'm three. still four. Yeah, yeah Ferg is Ferg is three. Yes, I'm three. Oh, and, Ferg is three. No, no, no. So Harper's three. Oh, Ferg is yeah, four. I'm four. Okay. Five. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, so, I'm already confused. <laughs> and it, it, it'd be We're really lost. cool because once we like after working with each other for a while, we like might be able to get down to where li li we're literally just like hey one. You know what I mean? Especially over JTechnet, I'm like hey one, hey two. Hey, you know what I mean? Oh, and you're yeah. like, hey, one. Hardcore. Like, well. Yeah, just so that it's like super simple and we just really know each other. Just, you know, I'm probably just going to say like, same. And back in the RTO days, and like, over the platoon, <laughs> it's just like one yeah, second. Numbers are hard, okay? Yeah. Because you're I can't in the Air count Force. Five, all right? The only reason, uh, yeah, the only reason why it has a number is just because call signs need a numerical number. So it, it does not have to be like, you don't have to like say the number. It's just because they need it. Right so down, like Mark, an eight digit grid. And I'm yes. Like, Fuck, is the, the so is the plan if all five of us show up one night? Is it mainly kind of going to be like a two, two and two and two squad, or what's the plan for that? So if all of us are on, honestly, like I don't mind putting a JTEC on every squad, and then I'll just run with company and oversee and let you guys handle mm -hmm. it. Because okay. I mean, I you know, and that's going to be up to you guys, or you could run two separate. We could do like per platoon, and then just run a primary and a secondary on each platoon. Um, that way you but, can go fuck off to an L pop or something. And you yeah, just, like, the, the cool vibe. thing about it being, <laughs> the, yeah, the cool thing about it being with each squad is that will give Caps so much tasking and you oh know my what god, mean? it will give them a lot of stuff to do. So I really like that. Oh, but yeah. um, yeah, we could be fun too. Yeah, we can see, we can <laughs> see. Uh, oh, it's down with your tech buddy. <laughs> or we could do like, I, well, there's so many things we do. We could do where I just ask you guys and one person, one. Two of you guys act as actual JTACs and run with the platoon, and then two of you guys act as a forward observer team, and you guys are like a recon element that scouts a, scouts LZs ahead. So like while the other two saber. guys are worrying about That's what's going like... on right now, <laughs> yeah, you know wow. what I mean? While the other two guys are what, worrying about what's going on right now as far as fires and logistical needs, you guys are planning ahead and planning LZs for future you know, targets and things like that, so we'll figure it out. There's a lot of stuff okay. we can do. Alright. I'm excited. I'm pumped. Like I'm yeah, pumped. Cars, cars, cars rock, bro. Sound, <laughs> that does sound like a lot more better. Like, this, this, op this opportunity sounds a lot better than the actual first roll JTAX. Yeah. <laughs> this is honestly, this I wish I was a JTAX now when this and all this is happening. Well, well, man, we're, we're, we're going to Cavs We're going to Sorry, man, right? Yeah. yeah. Well, well, actually, actually, Harper, we're, we're a Cav too. Are you not in Cavs? I'm sorry. That's what I said. Oh, no. Oh, no. Hey, remove him from internal. Listen, <laughs> hey, just quick question. Starting off this off, it's going to get a little spicy, dude. They're going to be mechanized and, uh, and uh, sand oh, yeah. sites. Sorry, yeah. Staff Sergeant's highest rank as a JTEC. I, yeah, believe. I mean, so, like, it's is rank progression going to be the same as, um, it's gonna as, be same as yeah. infantry? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. exactly. Do we, do, do we go to you, Barbell, for our rank, our rabbit? Or yeah, yeah. We... Okay. So yeah, so like promotion take... boards. So so the rank's going to yeah. be multiple parties, so it's it's going to be through us and then through Marty. 
Uh, and through the battalion. Yep. That yeah. makes sense. So yeah, when you guys are ready, you guys go to them, and then they'll send me the recommendation, and then I'll, as as a liaison, I'll just send it up to battalion and see if they approve. Yeah, because all all E fives now go through battalion, so everything is E five basically. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then <laughs> so, um, you guys, you guys might be getting demoted to specialist. What? I have oh, to great, because that. of the new. We have new rank changing things coming down. Yeah. I have to. I have to look into it. I'll, yeah, I'll look into the it. thing that was I do not care. As, I'm silly as for forces and communication. So okay, okay, yeah. Since and you guys classify as SF, then you'll keep it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god. I'll just right. jump straight to E5. Damn, it should get knocked down to my level. I think right, technically yeah. they should all jump to E5. Yeah, you, sh you would all. For special Iron forces, guys, we would be all E5. The pipeline yeah. for CCT is e two and a half years, and you guys would all be E5s by now. Yeah. Um, you also yeah, just... it's like the tag P, it's like two yeah. and a half, and then it's yeah. fucking insane. Also, I'm still working Air Force ranks, because uh, I think that'd be cool, but. Yeah. Tech Sergeant, I'm Staff Sergeant. Staff Sergeant! Yeah, no, but then again, like as an E6, I mean, you would just be a. You know I mean, like it's it. There's no difference. Yeah. I say yeah. you just be a technical sergeant. Yeah, sergeant. you just have blue instead of green. Yeah, <laughs> I think it looked cool. And the problem is they they wear multi cam too, so it's not like you guys get cool like different. Well, Air we Force use OCPs. Uh, I, I would like my uh, <laughs> I, I would like my, my, my like hat, my special hat, you know. Yeah, we're trying. I'm trying. <laughs> <laughs> they're very they're very serious about this this hat. <laughs> Hats are very. Yeah. The of that, okay? yeah, really. Hey, no, hey, hey. Oh my I gosh! Got, just tell them that, that hats are now allowed to be worn in the Air Force now. They are soft cover. That's true. <laughs> and we are allowed to wear them now. But alright, boys, I'm gonna go hang out with the missus. All right. I'll catch y'all. Yeah, see you guys later. later yeah, I'm excited. Yeah. Later, boys. See the rest of you guys. Yeah, 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 yeah. Alright, these are disconnected from your channel. Oh, I'm gonna dab. I'm gonna, I'm gonna dab on the haters and uh, yeah, I eat myself. See you, done. Yeah, I'm out. I gotta go eat. See ya. See you later. Thanks, Ferguson. Yeah. Yep. Thanks, uh, See you later, Thickman. You leaving too? User left your channel. User oh, yeah, for left those your channel. who got the uh, con op. Wait. Oh yeah, yep. I never yeah, uh, for Saturday. Dude, by the way, I, I yeah, saw yeah. you practicing, uh, flying like all the today. <laughs> you get a little bit more a better feel. Uh, so like... this whole campaign with the whole Ukraine thing, we're gonna yeah. encounter lots of radar guided SAMs. Oh yeah. Which means you will probably utilize boats awesome. and really high halo jumps. Yeah. To get into the uh, LZs. Cool. To clear we'll them. probably have a couple blades on for seed. Sleep. Yeah, like, I remember uh, how to use a parachute. How to drive a boat and how, how to jump out of a plane. <laughs> yeah, you better get some combat jumps in there. I'm sorry. Channel switched. Hello?